at 2385 Ursula Drive, or yeah, uh, it's on the. This is a corner lot on the corner of Julie and Ursula. So it's a large lot, it's 0.4 acres. Here's the neighborhood. Cool to sec there. It's kind of the back corner of the neighborhood, so not much traffic whatsoever. Really nice. So you got a red fence all the way around the back. The garage is on the side, so you come in from the Julie Lane, but then your address is actually Ursula. So let's walk in. So this house has been completely remodeled. Roof looks great, architectural shingles. A lot of little finishing touches on here, such as these light fixtures, all the light fixtures and fans inside have been replaced. Really nice door. All right, we come in, just starts out as a wow factor. Really nice, walks into the living room. You can see straight out to the back. So again, here's some great light fixtures. Everything's been replaced. There's also cam lighting in here with a fan. So everything's got a beach theme. Really cool. So this is living room number one. There's also kind of a den area as well. So when you walk in, you come into this, you turn to the left and you have your formal dining. Again, brand new fixtures, archway coming in, really nice, beautiful furniture. Nice touches, lots of natural lighting coming in. All right, masters to the right, we'll go there in a little bit. Come around to the corner, have the breakfast nook here. Opens up to the den in the back. To the kitchen as well. Again, everything's been redone to the tile floors. Tile floors are all in the wet area, such as kitchen, bathroom, and everything's pretty much matching. And then in the, all the other areas, you have the wood plank. Not real hardwood, but really nice quality. So here's the other den. Good sectional couch. Looks out to the pool area from here. So you can see that. So a couple stools here. So here's the bar top, it's white. You can kind of see the sparkles, really cool. Great contrast with the color of the cabinets, which is really nice, gives you that nice contrast. Over here, you kind of have kind of whatever you want to make it. If you want that to be where your keys are, make it a coffee bar kind of anything. Got a nice large walk-in pantry. We'll start on this side. We have two bedrooms on this side. Come down the hall. These two bedrooms have a Jack and Jill. So this is the larger of the two. Really large, looks out to the back. If you open those up, you'll have tons of natural light coming in. A little cloudy today. Really nice large room great suite has a walk-in closet which is fabulous large walk-in then we come into the jack and jill which enters into the second bedroom on this side as well so you have a double vanity here it's been painted and redone the same exact countertop as well keeps with the theme throughout the house great lighting and then you come in here there's a door for the shower water closet okay so we enter into the second bedroom. They gonna have this as an office, extra room. Still really cool, good size room for sure. Cause definitely still fit a full size bed in here. Have plenty of room. Another walk-in closet, tons of storage. Let me see. No. Okay. I'm gonna come back into the hallway. So again, straight ahead to the kitchen, the den. Then we're gonna take a right. And we're gonna have a half bath right here. So a little powder room. So this also close to the garage. If you're outside, you come in here. Linen closet on that side. Updated vanity. And then when you come in this way, you have the laundry room. Really good size laundry room, tons of storage. More storage on this side. And then when you go out straight this way, come out to the garage. So tons of storage in here. There's your water heater, HVAC systems over here in the corner as well. 
which looks great. So good two car garage. They have tons of shelving and such in here as well. All right, now let's go to the other side of the house and we'll go to the master bedroom. All right, coming across through the living room, through the main living room again. French doors to go outside. Now you come into the master suite. Brand new fan, light fixture in here. Really cool accent tables. Kind of mismatching, I love that. Bench on the end. Cool TV stand. French doors that go outside. So tons of room. They've got a big massage chair in here. Cool side tables. All right, now we come into the ensuite, which is very grand and fabulous. You see we have that tile again in here. Cool chandelier. We have the his and hers uh, closets, and then we also have a large walk-in shower, which is amazing. Glass fixture, a little sitting. And we have the double vanity with the really cool beachy lights. And then we have all the shells around framed the mirror, which is a really cool touch. Just ties the whole house together. So walk-in closet number one, amazing cool jetted tub, really modern, got some cool buttons on it, really big, cool decor, nice step which is really great, and then walk-in number two, some more cool shelving, and then we have the water closet in here, nice little space with the door to be able to shut it. All right, we'll walk outside from the French doors over here. Have the full effect. So when you come out from the main living area, we have this great covered porch. So have all this, tons of room for outdoor kitchen, tons of pa uh, patio furniture. Come out to this gorgeous pool. So the liner looks great. Have the option of covering it if you would like. Have all this space over here for the yard. To add a garden for dogs. You have a walking path that goes to the gate to the side that goes to the driveway on the side of the house. You also have a double gate there to bring anything in. Really great trees, tall fence. You can't really see your neighbors on the side. And you also have a shed in the back. You can see they have a sea -doo back there. So that's where you can keep your lawn mower, anything you like. And then you have all this space over here as well for kids, dogs, etc. Did you think the outdoor kitchen Let me know if you have any questions. Again, 2385 Ursula Lane.